In a world where numerous living beings require help and understanding, one person's actions can become a ray of hope for a defenseless creature. This story is about how a single encounter can transform into a profound bond and friendship between a bird and a human. <coughs> Returning fallen nestlings back to their nests is not only a kind act, but also the right thing to do, saving their lives and helping maintain the natural order of nature. However, sometimes circumstances align in a way that makes returning the chick to the nest impossible, as was the case this time when neither a nest nor adult birds were nearby. In such situations, people step in, becoming foster parents for the young birds. That's precisely how, on May 22nd, the man became a savior for the chick, and from that moment, their remarkable story began. The abandoned chick cried for help all day, but as soon as it felt safe, the cries ceased. On the third day, the man decided it was time for the chick to adapt to the wild. The chick made clumsy attempts at flying and walking. The man understood that it would take some time, but he was confident the chick would manage. During the moments of rest between feedings, the chick preferred to take short naps. A couple of days later, the chick was already able to sit on a perch. Each day, it grew more downy, and the changes in its plumage became evident. It was also decided to introduce it to water procedures once it was ready. As soon as the chick felt prepared, it promptly jumped into a homemade bath and began cleaning its feathers independently. <laughs> it clearly took pleasure in this process. The chick couldn't yet cover long distances in flight, but it could already hop from one leg of its owner to the other. By the 10th day, the chick still couldn't forage for food on its own. The man knew that he could only release it to freedom when it became capable of feeding itself. By the 15th day, the chick had learned to use its beak to pick up various items and food, becoming stronger and more intelligent in the process. Certainly, the chick had shown attachment throughout almost all this time, often perching on the man's shoulder to convey its hunger and desire to eat. A few days later, it gladly started circling around the man's house and garden. Whenever the man called, the chick would land on his shoulder without hesitation. When the chick had already learned to forage for food independently and fly confidently, the man decided it was time to set it free. However, after a few attempts, it became evident that the bird had no intention of leaving its savior. Most likely by then, the man had become more than just a person to the bird. He had become a part of its family. Their bond continued to strengthen with each passing day. The bird, loyal to its friend, would return to him after every flight, whether near or far. <laughs> that was a However, on that particular night while staying outside, it did something remarkable. It befriended other birds, but didn't choose to fly away with them. It was an incredible testament to its attachment to the man who had always been its home and family. When people take on the responsibility of caring for defenseless animals, they perform a great act of kindness, helping to maintain the balance in nature. In gratitude for this care, nature bestows upon them a unique bond that fills their lives with joy, loyalty, and moments of happiness. We'll take that as a yes. <laughs>